school watch tonight. It is back to school night at Seaside Middle School. Uh, this comes on the same day that the state's new Common Core assessment test results were released. Action News reporter Lauren Siever is live in our Salinas newsroom with what parents are saying about the scores. Yeah, Erin, as uh, students and parents walked around Seaside Middle School learning uh, the curriculum and meeting the teachers, we decided to conduct our own learning experiment. Take a look. It's back to school night at Seaside Middle School. Students, parents, and teachers filled the halls excited for the upcoming school year. So the theme tonight is Together We Rise, and as such, that means uh, parents, students, and teachers with the goal of uh, setting high expectations for all students. And if we all come together, we can achieve that goal. Back to school night for Seaside Middle happened to fall on the same day the state's new Common Core assessment results were released. And Monterey County has some work to do. Only a third of Monterey County students met or exceeded the English standards. That's 12 percentage points behind students statewide. This year is truly is a baseline uh, year for everyone, our district, the county, the state. And um, now it's time to really look at that data, understand where our kids um, fell short and how we're going to put a plan together for improvement. We decided to put our interviewees to the test. We found sample test questions online and asked them two simple math questions. One for third grade, the other for sixth. I think it's this one right here. No. No. Yes. No. So is it A or B? A. B. A. Good job! The students did very well. Then we turned the tables and asked the parents and teachers to do the exact same two problems. <laughs> Yeah, I got to yeah! win. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> mm, uh, seven times six. No. Nice mm. job. All right. So you got that's third grade math. Okay. Though. Okay. So right. here we go. Now we're going to sixth grade. Most of them did pretty well, but weren't as confident as the kids, who are using the shift in testing questions to exercise real-world scenarios and questions that require critical thinking, uh, the setting them on the right path for college. Are you looking to go to college? Yes. What do you want to do? I want to be a police officer. You guys ever thought about college? Yeah. Yes. Yes. I'm going. You looking to go to college? What yep. do you want to do? Um, I want to be a heart surgeon, so I'm going to UCLA. Oh, you got it all planned out. I want to be either an art teacher or an artist. Now, because this is a new testing system, educators are asking parents to take the results with a grain of salt. The numbers are expected to be lower since this is all a part of a transition to Common Core standards, which they say are more rigorous. And Erin, those test questions, they were pretty hard. Hey, I'm right there with those educators. I'd be doing the high fives to get the third grade math right, Me too. Me, too. Agreed. <laughs> Thank you, Lauren. Parents in Monterey County Public Schools should be looking for the results by the end of the month.